Hello, I'm Julie Brown, and I am talking about the new AviQ 0.1 milligram epinephrine auto injector that is designed for infants and toddlers. This device has 0.1 milligrams of epinephrine. It is designed and FDA approved for infants and young children weighing 7.5 to 15 kilos or 16.5 to 33 pounds. It has all the great features of the existing AviQ devices. It has audible commands and a retracting needle that injects and then retracts back up into the device. It has a very clear needle end, so it would be very hard to use upside down by mistake. It also has a convenient shape that fits nicely into a pocket, or that allows two to fit nicely into a pocket, since of course you should always carry two. This 0.1 milligram device has a lower dose that makes it possible to dose infants and young children closer to the recommended ideal dosing range of 0.01 milligrams per kilogram. While good pharmacokinetic data are lacking in this weight range, this is the established preferred dose, so it is great to be dosing infants closer to this ideal. Perhaps even more importantly, this device has a shorter needle. The exposed needle length on this device is 7.4 millimeters versus 12.7 millimeters on the 0.15 milligram device. Here you can watch the difference as these two devices fire. Ultrasound studies suggest that after compressing the device to activate it, the needle of the 0.15 milligram epinephrine auto-injector devices may be long enough to hit bone in about 30 to 40 percent of children who weigh less than 15 kilos. This device is designed with a needle length that will not hit bone in any of these children. This device is not available at local pharmacies. Your doctor can order it by using a mail order pharmacy in their electronic ordering system or by faxing in a special form as well as the prescription to the company. You can find out more information on the AviQ website. Thank you very much. I would greatly appreciate your support of our anaphylaxis research by subscribing to my YouTube channel at the link below this YouTube video. And we always appreciate your support to our anaphylaxis research fund at the address shown. And I just want to make it clear that I have nothing to disclose. I have no financial relationships or other agreements with any epinephrine auto injector company. Thank you and have a great day.